to another Days Gone video and welcome. Obviously, we are at the end of the game. We've already done the finale and I've, again, I'm just going to reiterate how good this game is. Please, guys, if you haven't, if this is the first time you've clicked on a Days Gone video for me, please go play it for yourself and then come back to these videos. I uh, Honestly, to be quite fair, even if you watch these videos, even though the story sort of is spoilt for you, you still... You could do any of this stuff yourself in whatever order you like. You can do these side missions in whatever order and all that. Obviously, somewhat the main story is in an order, obviously, but you can still go off and do your own stuff. You can go and do the infestation zones and all that before that if you want. Um, but again, I'm going to reiterate, this game has got so... I, um, me and another YouTuber have just recorded a podcast speaking about our top five games of all time i mean i think this would honestly make my top five if i've got to be honest with the way this game is and how good it is and the fact being a long game and it kept my interest it kept everything good there was not a bad thing about this game yeah had to, it has to get in there and not only that it's got everything like i love zombie games i love open world games i love gun games i love the stories I love it. But anyway, guys, I will be just doing the side missions. I will be showing you absolutely everything. I just kind of want to see how far I can get into this. I want to see how close I can get to 100% in this game. So I'll probably just play quite a bit. Like as I can't say how much how much commentary there will be. I'll probably come in here with a quick quip in here in there. But I'll um. There's a lot of hordes to kill. There's a lot of infestations. So unfortunately, I've got to do a lot of like finding materials to get molotovs and all that bullshit so i've got to do all that f first before i can do anything else so we'll see how it goes guys without further ado let's get back into it okay let's see if we can find these rings up there we're on about finish this one thing Weaver, I'm at the location where she was last spotted. You found her? Not yet, but I uh, found. Good luck, man. Weaver out. Okay, what happened? Uh, the bike broke down, and you weren't too happy about that. I don't blame you. Uh, small boot prints. That's got to be hers. Uh, they're heading this way. What was that? She must have dropped something. What did you drop, Crystal? Because whatever it was, you wanted it back real bad, didn't you? What is this? A ring? Okay, I got one of them back. More boot prints this way. Gotta take a closer look. What's this? Oh, yellow snow. I mean, shit, if you gotta go, you gotta go. You ain't concerned about anything out here, are you, Crystal? More boot prints in this way.
this the same place we got it from last time? So hard. Well, you keep picking the wrong friends. Screw you. Oh, hold on. Do you not remember me? Oh, I remember you. Standing up on the stage, kissing the colonel's ass like a good little soldier. Okay, well, do you know why I'm here? <laughs> I figure the son of a bitch weaver put a bounty on my head. So do it already. I don't give a shit. What the hell are you doing? 
Stop, I'm not gonna kill you. I just need the rings. Those are my goddamn rings. The son of a bitch has stolen from me. They're yeah, mine. Yeah, yeah, they are. But the bike you rode out here, that wasn't yours, was it? And the guy that you killed to get it, well, he probably didn't give a fuck about your rings either. Okay, listen to me. If I see you again <laughs> in any camp from here to the Cascades, I'm gonna kill you. My advice, head east. I hear Reno's still standing. You can go to hell. Already there. Nice. Return to joy proof, okay. What? I just had this door open. Got it. around here. <laughs> okay, let's see what took a uh Exactly, we've not been here in a very long time. We've been around before. This drifter comes in. Hey, a deacon, right? How's the bike business going, Zanny? Okay. Hmm, thanks for stopping by. Hey, to see you, deacon. Okay, just stopping by. Yeah? Deacon, thank God. What's wrong, Tuck? It's rippers, more goddamn rippers. Oh, good rippers. Okay, where? They keep coming over the Iron View Pass. Now they've set up a camp along Bear Creek, just south of here. I'm afraid, Deke, if we don't stop them, what's gonna happen to the hot springs? I don't know, I get it, I get it. Don't worry about this, Tuck, I got this. What can I get for you? How's it going, Zanny? Hey, hold on. I've been pretty busy. Scouting party. Kill him! Kill him all! Yeah, talk. You don't gotta tell me. Say, John. Damn, Ripper's my friend. Arm because of you bastards. You wanna arrest him? Come on, come on. You wanna get low, huh? How many more of you? Oh, enough for it! Oh, 
Drugs slowing you down. Oh, damn rippers. Rest in hell. The lot of you. Woo. Okay. Well, I better get back, so. Ah. Let's do this, and probably after that, I might, I might go do a horde. Because to be honest, I think I don't know if they um, go up and down in sizes or raw. I mean, I know the one at the sawmill was massive. That's why it took so long. But the one at like um, at Iron Butte, that was a bit smaller and all that. So I'm hoping um, there's a few smaller ones. I mean, I think a horde just it's just a big collection of zombies. So we'll go to this first mission. I'm not too sure what. few things. I don't know how big this horde is going to be though. God, was that it? Okay. Bounties. Okay, fair enough. That's one of the bounties done. Wow. Them bombs worked an absolute treat. Really, them bombs worked a treat. How many that was to be honest because this is a pretty small cave. I've got quite a few of them. 
Fair enough, you know what, that was worth it. And le really, I really didn't use that much. I've still got two of them. I've not, I didn't even, I think I used like one, one napalm and a couple of bombs. I mean, I've still got, look at that, I've not, I didn't even use the remote bombs. Ricky, I'm at Malakwa Lake. Yeah, there's a camp full of drifters here. Can you handle them? Oh, uh, yeah, I got this, Deacon out. One more. One more. All right, boys. Why well, you thought you just set up camp in Lost Lake territory? Had the run of the place? Murderers and thieves, the lot of you. That's it. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Meet Ricky. Okay. Uh, no, might try to do some. Ricky know it's done. Uh, Ricky, it's done. I cleared out the camp full of drifters north of Malakwa Lake. Thanks, Deke. I'll let Boozer know. Oh, be sure to let Mitchell know it's safe to play outside again. He's just a kid, Deke. Yeah, well, if he wants to live long enough to become an adult, he better start learning how to use a gun. Yeah, you're right. I'll start working with him. Thanks, Deke.
Okay, so there's only a bit left. I did basically that with a couple of bombs as well. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off, dude. In shut up, you screaming bitch. Dear Cross, well, guess you don't have to be worried about traffic no more, do you? Okay, so we'll return to Iron Mike's. Got trust level three now, so we'll see what we can do. Someone here. The Liberator. Okay. Here you go. Hmm, that should work. Okay. Uh, good choice. Sweet, I good can one. actually buy some okay, then. of these. Sweet. Uh, hey, Deke. Be safe. Yo, Deke. How's it going, man? Joe. Alright, see you later, Deke. Got good shit in stock today. Buzz. Ooh. That's a good piece. Nice and sturdy. Bags. Um, what else can I get you? Sweet. I think everything's upgraded on this. Yep. Okay, okay. I'll top you off. Should have new shit later. Sorry. Stop by. Let me just, uh, I'm, I think I'm gonna have to just get some ammo for the other saddle bag I've just bought. <laughs> How's my favorite bounty hunter? How's life yeah. treating you, Blair? Okay, then. <laughs> Don't be such a stranger. There we are, I'll take that. How many, how many have I got now? Three. So I've got three loaded ammo hey, just to, to redo hey, everything. Boss. I'll, I'll, I'll do that. Deacon St. John, how have you been? Uh How's it going, Buzz? Okay, so let's go over here. At the Lost Lake Encampment Cemetery. Okay. Hey. 
Hey, Deku. Addie carved it herself. It's beautiful, right? Thanks. Yeah, it was in a piece of redwood that Mike kept in his room. He once told me that when things settled down, he was gonna make something out of it, like a <laughs> cribbage board. Wait, a what? A, he doesn't play cribbage. Mm. Iron Mike played cribbage. <laughs> no, no, but that's the point. That there'd come a day when something like that mattered again. Well, oh, what does it say? Yeah, don't look at me. I just carved it. It's a, it's an old Hindu proverb. My mother taught it to me. It reads, rivers do not drink their own water, trees do not eat their own fruit, and clouds do not swallow their own rain. What great ones have is always for the benefit of others. What do you think? Well, coming from you, I think that would have meant a lot to him. Yeah. Yeah, I think if Mike were here, he would probably say something like, what the hell does that even mean? <laughs> uh, come on. Yeah, no, you're right. <laughs> he would have said, what the hell does that mean? Followed by, what the hell are you doing standing around here? The world ain't gonna save itself, God damn it! Get right. to work. You're right again. Come on, guys, let's get to work. <sighs> Oh, did I ever tell you about the time that Iron Mike saw Addie and I for the first time at the lodge in front of the fireplace? Oh, this is funny. <laughs> okay, so we were tangled up. No, 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 no. We were all up okay, in Addie. it. What? Addie. Uh, uh, why? For the first time. And Iron Mike comes out and he looks at us. This. You can stop. He had that grin on his I'm face. not cool. You're such a perv. You are a That's nice. Saying goodbye to Iron Mike. I've got to say again, the fucking soundtrack, it proper gets to you. It has that moment of sombre where it just, you really just, you got to feel this game. It's just too, sometimes it can be too much, but in a good way. Can I help you? No, you're a cunt. Shut up. How's it going, Buzz? Leaving already? Bike is just so fast now. To say from what it was, it used to take ages to get to one place to the other. But now, oh my god, it's so good. I don't even worry about fast travel because it doesn't even take that long.
Come on. <laughs> he did. God damn it. I've not even had to. I've not even had to use the Molotovs just yet. Like with any of these um, hordes, I've just literally put down a couple of bombs, chucked a few things in there, and that's it. 